I am Dane Alexander Jufre, uh, and I am playing Omaru Velzarin, the Azamar Ranger. There's a couple of things that excite me the most about Omaru. From the crunch of it, I've actually never played a ranger, so I'm very excited to like dive into ranger and all of their bits and bobbles and what they can do. When I try to make characters, I think of race, sure, class, sure, scores, sure. Then I start to look at their background and more importantly, what their occupation might be outside of adventuring. I try to think of that to give my character a little bit more flavor. So I'm really hoping that like Omaru, who is a cartographer by trade, um, is something that I can lean on for story, to lean on for narrative. Omaru's main thing right now is they are trying to explore, discover, and chart as much of the world as they can. The world of Galvera, there is such a sense of mystery. As someone who likes to know things in general, like myself, um, that excites me to no end. I'm one of those people who kind of is really into the DM lore dump. Getting like a high score on a history roll <laughs> really excites me sometimes just because I could be like, ooh, how can I use this? If I can get involved in the story in that way, I think it pushes it even further. So that's what I love about Gavir right now is that there's not a lot I know yet, but so much I can learn. When we were developing the backstory and we were talking with other characters, I was able to have a really good conversation with another one of our players, Olivia, uh, and we decided to have our characters be linked by just the city that grew up that we grew up in, Donick. We were able to work a little bit on that and include this beautiful backstory of us meeting when we were kids and growing up together and being separated by just the flow of what happens when you're either from high society or from uh, an impoverished side of the city. Um, some of that is race-based, some of that is based on just who we are in that city, and I am so hungry to explore that. I know that when I'm angry, I hit things. <laughs> <laughs> what got me interested in Dungeons and Dragons was I was asked to play in a game by Tanner. It's a home game that started in New York and then the pandemic hit and our DM and their partner left uh, to go to another state and we played for another year and a half after that, all over Zoom and Discord and however we could manage just to play online to make sure that we could still play. And the only reason we really, really did that was because of how gripped I was by this game after I started playing it, and now I can't stop. It is something that is gonna be a part of me for a very long time. I became a part of Roles Untold uh, by accident, was asked to play in a game. I was happy to say yes because I love playing D&D. Heard we were streaming, uh, and then luckily, uh, just by the grace of what I've been able to do throughout my career, have the expertise to bring in some of the video stuff, some of the audio stuff, and to make the stream come to life to sort of build out the studio that we're in now. Um, but that's how I got started. I thought we were just playing a game. The ropes again. Oh, oh, Amaru is the problem right now. And I struggled. I struggled <laughs> another game. The most rewarding thing I could say about producing this, being a part of the team, is the team. And I know that sounds very like cliche, whatever. I, I can't. I couldn't have asked for a better group of people to be working with. Truthfully, like if if we just got together and just. Uh, we're having a stream for no one at all. If we weren't playing d and I'd still be doing it. Everyone a part of this team is so in it, and they were in it from day one. It was astounding, and because of that energy, it's really pushed me and challenged me to continue to make this as best as we possibly can get it to be. I think what we're doing here is incredibly special, and I'm really excited to see what bumps in the road we hit what kinks in the piping we find and how we're able to tell this story together because I think the four of us and Tanner 
have really, really gotten close in the past couple of months. And we've been able to hit a really, really good vocabulary in how we talk and how we play and how we meld. And I'm excited to see what that looks like once we're all up and streaming. So tune in, you fucks. <laughs> 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 okay.